thank Honorable Ogene for this very important motion. And it makes one have a rethink that in this country today, we know how funds or revenue for the governments are very difficult, considering the numerous projects and liabilities that government has to undertake. Now, um, if you look at the solid mineral sector, Mr. Speaker, honorable colleague, in the last dispensation, when the Avocat Buari Bauer was the minister and Femi Fayemi were the minister of solid minerals, they brought up an issue where they wanted us to have the, we have the solid minerals development fund, which they want it to be on first order, and they wanted it to be increased by certain percentage. I'm not sure if that was passed, but Mr. Speaker and Honorable Colleague, I think this is time we can look at that law. Because what we need to do is to make sure that artisan uh, miners have access to fund. Because most of the problems they have is their inability to, to procure equipments that they will use. And if you look at the large scale miners, miners, the issue is accessibility to where all the solid minerals are deposited. Coupled with that is the insecurity we have in the country. So, in as much as we want to diversify, I think certain things need to be put in place. And very importantly, like I said, is for us to pass this legislation that will increase the percentage of money that is available for the solid mineral scale, I mean, uh, fund, which will make funds available, like I said, to our artisan uh, miners and also for the big scale miners. And that will be a very big incentive. We can look at that. And Mr. Speaker, I want to thank again. I think we should, it's not even about, the solid, about gold alone. I think all the solid minerals, because when, uh, Nigeria is really uh, endowed with a lot of solid minerals, which can really help the revenue base of our country. And that even brings to fore, I would have said, even instead of increasing the VAT, I think this is a sector that we can now look at and make sure that it will even augment what we are even supposed to have from the increment of VAT that we are thinking of at 7.5. I, I hardly support this bill, I mean this motion, and I want the Committee on Solid Minerals to look at that section or to be sure if we have passed it or if Mr. President has ascended to it and to make sure that it is implemented because it is a different thing to pass uh, a bill and it's another thing to make sure that it is implemented and we have the legislative compliance to be sure that the funds are available. The Solid Minerals Committee will take a very cursory look at how this Solid Mineral Development Fund is disbursed to make sure that it meets the need of the solid mineral, uh, solid mineral Development. Thank you.